What up, Joe? It started with the <laughs> penis part. Y'all ain't ready for this one. They ain't ready. Do you mean and Brando? Come on. Who was? Yo, what up, Toe? It's your boy DME. I'm back. I'm back because URL, URL keeps dropping, dropping announcements, which is cool. Which is cool. It looks like this might be the last one. Chef Tress versus Chess. Chef Tress versus Chess at Norb. The night of the random battles is coming to you live, December 9th. All right, Norb. I wonder who had whose idea this was. I wonder whose idea this was. All right, I don't know. I don't know. I mean, okay, okay. I mean, Chess. Chess is coming off a, 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 a bad battle against JC. Like, let's, let's, let's be real. Let's be real. I mean, he, he, he had a good, I think, first round. Or, and he, I feel like he choked every round. I don't know. You know, that battle was hard to get through. It was really, it was, it was, it was, come on, Chess. Come on, Chess. What, 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 I understand you're young, bro. I understand you're a young boy. You know, we get it. We get it. We, we get you guys. You get you guys. You know, there's been plenty of battlers that have been very young and, and and come up through the ashes and, and you know that but so we, we can't keep playing that game you're getting names you're getting names and um you know that's on a url to not you know have pushed you so fast if that's the case and, and you don't really win battles you know you really don't win any battles i don't know what you what battle you've ever won you know you like you lost to tay rock you had a fire first round and then there was another and you, you throw up behind half your battles and you choke and you know you got saliva coming up your i don't know what's going on with this guy i don't know i don't know but I you know Chess when he's on, he's on, he's fire, he's fire. Chef Trez, Chef Trez, this is so crazy. Like, I don't know what's going on with Chef Trez either. Like, this is what I'm saying. Like, I don't, I don't know. Maybe there's some kind of rhyme or reason that I don't know about here, but it is what it is. You know, he just came off the I just watched the prep battle. Fire battle. Fire battle. Uh Chef Trez has had a lot of good battles, man. His battle with Ryder. He didn't beat Ryder though. I might have had prep winning that battle 2-1 against Chef. I don't, I gotta watch that again. I gave it one quick watch, you know, not really like paying my full attention to it. All right, I know prep had a, like a great third round. I remember that much. But um, this is like, it's weird. It's weird. Just, it's everything on this, the only one, only, only, only matchup that really makes sense is, is, is B-Magic and Av because that was supposed to happen. And, you know, B-Magic, you know, the C-Magician, you know, he did what he did and, and you know, and then stole the money. And, and then, we, then we had to pray for St. Louis and all that stuff. And that's when, you know, St. Louis had their little, you know, rebellious revolt against the, the URL, which they claimed it wasn't a set. Ah, you guys are funny. You guys are funny. Everybody from St. Louis decided to not come to that event. You know, that was, that was kind of weird. That was kind of weird. So, um, I don't know, boys. What you think about this? It's, this is this is a it's an interesting battle. You know, the small room. You know, I think will lend uh, will lend both of them very well. Like, uh, I think Chess would do good in the small room. I think. I, I it looks look Chess. If you choke in the small room, you know, in front of like you know a, a select group of special people, <laughs> but whoever's invited, I don't know who's invited. But you know what I mean. You know, select group of uh, of battle rappers and, and and bloggers and fans or whatever, and you start choking in front of them. It's gonna look bad, man. It might look worse than than it did than your chokes on a big stage because, you know, it's like you know. First of all, you have the stigma now of of, of choking, and um, that stigma is bad. So when you have that stigma, you know, you can't come into your next battle to, and choke again. Like, yeah, people. Expect it from you, but man, it's like if you keep doing it, then it, it comes to a point where it's like, what are we doing with this guy? What are we doing? Does he really deserve anyone else after this? Should we send him back to the PGs? Uh, he does numbers. He's popular. He 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 gives good performances usually, you know. But you got to bring it all together, bro. You got to bring it all together. You can't it can't can't just be this. It can't just be this. All right. It can't it can't be where you're just you know you're you got all this talent. And everything, and you can't put it together because eventually talent can only get you so far. You know, you gotta, you gotta put it together. You gotta figure this out. You know, and I, you know, I sympathize with you because you are so young. But you know, there comes a point where you, you know, you're in it. You're in it, and you, you gotta, you gotta be a man and and take it how anyone, how a grown up would take it. So I don't know, man. I, I, if I had to pick, I'm go. I, I, you know, if Chess doesn't, if Chess comes through with three, well, I mean, obviously, if, if you could say this about anybody, well, you know, I'm thinking about that now, so it doesn't really sound like what I was going to say. If Chess comes through with three fire rounds, and he's going to win. But yeah, but if, if Chef Trez comes with three fire rounds, and he could win, but it's, you know. So, but I'm, what I meant was, like, like if he doesn't, you know, doesn't choke, doesn't stumble, doesn't throw up, you know, doesn't um, get the hiccups, you know, then then I, I, I would say that he, he will beat him. You got Chef Trez, you know, three of them things, you know. He he's good, man. He's good, but I feel like there's always something missing. With Chef. Am I crazy? But what? There's something missing with Chef Trez. I don't know what it is. He's got talent too. He's good. He doesn't screw up that much. You know, like I don't think he chokes or anything. Uh, he he's pretty solid, and his rebuttals are are, are, are fire usually. And I, and I respect rebuttals a lot. I respect freestyling a lot because to me that's that's talent. That's talent. 
But uh, there's just something there, and I don't, I don't know if it's the weird push that URL's giving them. This is the problem with the way they, they, they release their battles. You know, you, you, you know, and then I don't know. It's like, I don't know. What, what, it's like Chef Trez one minute, he's on, uh, uh, what is it, Ascension, then he's back to a PG, then he's, he's on here and there. I don't know. It's just, it's just weird. Now he's on Smack, and, I, and we don't, like, is Smack, is, is this Smack series? You know, is it just, is it ran, is it just going to be randoms put together? Or is it going to be a mix of the um, of vets and the new guys? I, or I feel like it's just random. I feel like this this new Smack volume thing series is going to be random. And I know there's going to be more of them. You know, obviously, because it's volume one. So obviously, there's going to be more. There's going to be more. But um, um, I don't know. Uh, you know, so I, I like the idea. I really do. The other other battles are, you know, the Mike P thing uh, and Suge. I'm, like, like, yeah, you know, he just battled Big T, Mike P. He's like, Mike P. said so they give him Suge, Big, Big T, then Mike P. Or, or Suge. But it's just, I don't know. It's just weird. Um, and then, you know, Suge, Suge had a, had a, had a, had a he lost to Ill, but a good performance, a good performance. <clears throat> so, I don't know, man. Um, that's what's happening. Uh, that's probably the last battle. I mean, I'm assuming there's only going to be six. I would think that, that that's all you really need. I don't know. I think you can start getting a little, I think five is the right number. I think six is the max. And anything after that, it's like, all right, you know. You know, it's just, it's battle rap. Like, how many battles are we going to watch in one night? You know, they can only ask the fans so much. That's what happens to the main events. That if you put too many battles on them, and the way that, that you know, it smacks on RNT all the time, so the battles don't start till, people start at 2 p.m., they don't start till 6 p.m., they don't end till mid freaking midnight, and everybody's drunk and high by the time midnight comes around, and they don't even care about the last main event. It's, and then the crowd gets, oh, but, it, you know, the crowd is going to be the small crowd. But still, you got you know, even the small crowd can get a little, get a little antsy. And it's not like, okay, just because it's in a small room, there's still going to be a reaction. 60 people is still a lot of people. 60 people can make noise. You know, 60 people is not like, you know, nobody, you know, it's not a quiet room, it's a small room, so there's still going to be, you know, reactions and crowd control you're going to need, there really is, it's not just going to be nothing, you know, it's going to be, I it might, it might give you that old time, um, grind, grind time feel, you know, which I, I loved, I loved, you know, I am a fan, I, I like the big, I think there's a place for it, the big stage and the small stage, I think there's places for it, I think your Summer Madness, obviously, your Gnomes, obviously, and then I think everything else should be small, I think those should be the only two events where they have the big stage and everything else should be a small stage, Born Legacies, I, you know, that's a whole other story, I don't know, I don't know. That's an interesting topic right there. But maybe Born Legacies is kind of like that in between small stage, big stage kind of deal. Like that's kind of how they do it right now, anyways. But you know, I, I don't know, man. It's it's it, I, I, hopefully it's good. You know, I've decided I'm gonna order the pay per view. I have to. I have to. You know, you're not gonna get Chris Unbias off the off your trailers. Uh, but but you know, that's not gonna stop me. That's not gonna stop me. You you you'll 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 deal with that. You you you'll. you'll, you'll You'll, you'll get the repercussions for that one day, you know, you know, from your soul, from your soul, URL. But, you know, it, it, me not buying the pay-per-view is only really going to hurt me. You know, like, who, who, I just not going to see it. Like, well, my, my 30 bucks or whatever is not going to, you know, uh, hurt your pockets. So whatever, bro. But And then I'm not going to get to see the battles that I want to watch. So I'm not hurting myself, for, all right, because you guys are stupid. All right? So no boycott. No boycott. We're going to buy it. We're going to buy it, and uh, we'll see. But um, I don't know, boys. Until next time, peace.